Greetings and welcome back to our Let's Play Pokemon Platinum version. So in the last episode we managed to get through... We managed to get through uh, the cycling road and we also got the Versus Seeker, revived a fossil. And now we're going to be taking the time to go through Wayward Cave and you will need Flash or a map, which... I personally prefer to have on the side to help me get through this so I don't have to come back to this later. So hang on a sec, let me just go ahead and pull up my map. Alright, and let's go ahead and do this. We're going to be going through this in the dark. Now, if you're playing this on Diamond or Pearl, you will most likely need Strength. Either way, you are going to need Rock Smash in order to get through this place. So let's come up here. I think the map is a little different. Hmm. Either that or I am looking in a completely wrong area. Yes, I am. So let's just go ahead and run from that. We're going to go ahead and pull up our repels. Bag. Use. That way we don't have to deal with it. And let's see, is there anything nearby? No, there isn't. Alright, so. There I am. We're going to try to get to the corner first. As I come through here. Uh, I think that's where I am. Oh man, this is terrible. Okay, I think I know. I'm almost at the corner. So let's head up here. Surprise, I haven't run into anyone yet. I guess that's a good thing. Get him lost in Wayward Cove. Woo! Double battery! I knew there would be enemies eventually. I just didn't know when. Dun, dun, bum, 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 who's I, 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 Good job, team. Alright, so there's an item right there. And we found a revive! We better check the area. And I'm getting nothing on the radar. We're gonna go ahead and use another repel here. I don't feel like dealing with all these, uh... Okay, so I'm in the top left corner. Alright. Let's go to the bottom left. Make our, or stumble our way there. Uh, this is the only problem with these type of repels. They go away, or they get used up so damn easily. And we got ourselves into another double battle. Unfortunately, the map I'm using, thanks to Bulbapedia, for getting me through this uh, particular area, does not uh, mention trainer locations. Gee. I wonder who has what. God damn it, come on. Psychic with that, and flamethrower the other. And we just took down the uh, one person. That means if Porygon fails, Charmeleon will be there to mop up. Why? Because 
Well, Charmeleon's a bit slower than Porygon Z here. Ooh. Yes, Porygon. Let's just finish it up. Nice and easy. You are! You're the one who's crying now. Uh-oh. You heard crying deep in the cave. I wonder what that could be. It must be someone who's lost in the cave. We got ourselves double team! Alright, I know where that is, so we need to... Head this way. Let's go ahead and knock that out. And we're going to go ahead and rush our... Oh, that's a dead end. Let's come down this way. And we came across a couple of hikers, it looks like. Oh my god. I am being surrounded by pedophiles! We must dispose of these guys quickly. Dragon Rush! And do another one. Uh, I really hate the, uh, the, the redone battle, or multi-battle mechanics for trainer battles. Meaning you, know, you could end up targeting nothing just because they, they only replace the Pokemon after the fact. I really hate it. And it looks like I have come across another dead end. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and... Let's see if I have a super repel by any chance. Hard, armor, armor, and alright. Let's just go ahead and stick with our current strategy of using repels every hundred steps. Yeah, I don't feel like dealing with the uh, Zubat attack force right now. And, alright, I know where that is. Let us come around this way. And that is also another dead end. I guess we got to uh, come up this way. Bum. <laughs> We are winning everything we come across. And we got an escape rope! Unfortunately, I don't think we can use it here. Let's come over here, see if oh, that's just a dead end. Hey, we found a green shard! I don't really know what the shards do in this game. Alright. Let us come down this way. I bet there is an item here. Nope. I was wrong. My repel wore off? God damn, that was fast. Well, at least I have an idea of how close uh, Porygon is to uh, leveling up. Let's go ahead and just use another repel here. And looks like we got ourselves a double battle. I kind of I don't mind it too much. I just hate the mechanic of a uh, wait until the end of uh, everyone's taking their actions before you can send out another one. It seems so wasteful. Okay. So, I'm going to try to make sure that I take out 
both of them. I think that's an excellent idea, but I don't know how well everyone's going to take it. Alright, one down. And there it goes. We are slowly leveling up. And we'll just go ahead and use Psybeam and another Flamethrower should that do the trick. And we defeated a couple of our lovebirds. Hanging out in the cave! I'm sure everything will be okay. Um, hmm. This is awkward. I might be lost. Because I can't seem to go down there unless I somehow missed a, a turn somewhere. Uh, I bet that was an item. Hey, yes! We have found a great ball. Too bad I won't be doing too much capturing. And so somewhere down here I need to make a turn. So let's go ahead and use another repel. Ah, damn, I'm, go I'm burning through these so fast. Yes, okay. And good job. I really hate this darkness. It makes it very difficult to navigate. And I can hear someone say, well, you should just teach someone Flash. Shut up. Flash is terrible. And then I could hear that same person say, but Dungeon Minister, with Flash you won't be lost in the cave. I know that, but then it wouldn't be a challenge. So let's come down here. And we came across... Wow, that was weird. Bum. Was it me or was the music off? There. Something just didn't sound right. Come on, Charmeleon. Good job. Taking him down. And blows. Uh, it looks like a, it looks like one of those shields. It really does. I'm so glad I taught you how to use signal beam. God damn. These guys take forever to level up now. Either that or I'm just really overpowered. Nothing? Oh. There we go. Blue shard. Again, I don't know what the shards do offhand. Let's come up here. Hey. We're almost to the person that is chilling in the cave. Who also decided to come in the darkness. I was catching Pokemon and then I all lost. I'm so scared. Please. Yay. We have a, another person that we're going to help get out of here. It's too bad this has taken me much longer than I expected to get through Wayward Cave. Let's see. All right, I know where that is. And let's come, we need to come down here, come over here, through there, and we need to use another repel. Excellent. So let's come up here, we're going to need to make a left, then up, and then I think another, yep, up here. Ah, oh, this takes forever to get through here. My god. 
down this way. Another repel. Don't worry, Mara. We're going to get you through here. And one moment, ladies and gentlemen. My phone is going off. Sorry about that. And let's see, where was I? Can't remember if I came over here. Ah, oh, damn it. Yep. I am lost. Holy crap. Let's just make our way to the top up here. Another repel. I think I'm at the top, so I have a good idea at where I am in this cave. Let's come through here. Come down here. Over. Ah! Blasted! Foiled! I am trapped! No, wait, I know where I am now. Ah, I will get us through here. Down, over, this way, down, down, yes, down. We will get through here. We must get through here because we still have another part of Wayward Cave to get through. And we will try to do this in all one episode. It must be down here. And by the way, this Wayward Cave is the only place in the 4th Gen games where Flash is required as a field move. Oh, there's the exit! I want to get tougher so I won't be such a scaredy cat. Bye bye, thank you. And she can be a double uh, partner in much later on in the game. I don't know if I'll go through that. And we're going to go through the secret entrance here. If I can... There we go. We're going to go through the uh, second part in uh, one moment. All right. Let's take care of the other half. And this is lit up for us. But we do need the bicycle. By this point, you should have the bicycle. Whee! And we're gonna need more repels. God, I have just burned through like... Yes, we did it! Excellent, excellent, excellent. But I think I might need to go through here again because I did way too much. Damn it! Okay, so we need to one, two, three, and Ugh. another repel. Excellent. We need to speed up, and we will get through here. There we go. And looks like we gotta go through here again just to make our way over there. But we have a checkpoint. Let us go over the rocks and through the cave to where we need to go. Uh, I'm gonna end up burning through 2500 yen just to try and get through here. Excellent. Now we just need to come over here. And we are almost. We need to make sure that we get everything. And we've done it! We're back up here. That would seem to be totally pointless. I think. Yes, and I did forget something in here. You, this is the only place where I think you can find yourself a grip claw. Um, offhand, I do not know what the grip claw does, but I'm sure. If I remember, I'll leave a note in, somewhere in the video. Alright, I'll be back once I get outside of this cave. I lied! I just wanted to show you guys where you can get this item. So let me just go ahead and pop another repel. 
And when you're at the top left of the screen here, you're about to come over here, make sure you go really fast and you can get that item. Yes. We are going to come up here, get a little speed, make sure that we've gotten everything. Yes, we did. We've gotten all the items. Now we will see about getting out of here for good. There's probably a few hidden items. And this is probably the only place where you can find Gibble. So if you're looking for a nice dragon type early on in the game, this is the place for you to look. But you'll probably be here for a while. Yes. And especially if you don't use a lot of repels like I do, because... Well... As you can see, I've been using a lot of them. I came in here with 25 and now I have less than 10. Most because of my own stupidity of deciding to go through the darkness. Damn onyxes! I don't want you! I think I already have you. And... Hey! We got Earthquake! That's a little secret area that you, after you go through that maze. And we're gonna try to get out of here now. And speak of the devil! It's a gibble! And I think I'm quite powerful. I just want to see if I can try to catch one. Because it's so cute. Alright. Right you reversal. Good job. One more reversal should do, and then we can try to capture it. Because I'm beginning to take a lot more damage. And this is not good for the capturing. Pokeball! Go! Yes. Yes. Ah! No! Bad Gibble! You want to join me! Why aren't you affected? And they must have Sandstream. And I think my Raichu is going to go down pretty badly. Yep, it's going down. Wow. Good effort. Yes, we're going to use next Pokemon. We're going to bring out... Oregon! Come on, you can do it! I have belief in you! Pokeball Go again! One, two, three, and we've got a Gibble! And we will never use it! Lucky us! It attacks Gibble, land shark Pokemon. It attacks using its huge mouth. While its attacks are powerful, it hurts itself out of clumsiness. Too dumbass. And you're gonna stay in the box because I think you heard me call you that and you would probably want to try and exact your revenge against me. I don't want that. Because I am your loving master. Now we just need to get out of here. I could unintentionally capture the gibble, or intentionally. Whichever way you want to see it. I'm sure it'll be happy with me, along with all of my Pokemon. Alright, so let's get our way out of here. We now have Earthquake for one of my guys whenever the future may need it. Uh, let's just go ahead and use another Repel just so we can quickly get out of here. 
Come on! We're almost there. Let's drop it down! Good job. Good job, slave. Uh, it's gonna put you back in the box until whenever I need you again. Which I hope it isn't for a while. And I hope you guys liked this episode. Because in the next episode we're gonna go through the mountain and hopefully get to our next town. And until then, be sure if you like this, hit that like button. If you're new to my channel, be sure to subscribe so you can see whenever one of my new videos comes out. And I always love talking to you guys. So feel free to leave a comment in the comment section. Until then, or until next episode, or whatever I put up next, see you guys and take care.